The film The Other Side of the Door was released in 2016 and was directed by Johannes Roberts. This horror film follows the story of Maria, a mother who is grieving the loss of her son, Oliver, who died in a tragic accident. In an attempt to come to terms with her loss, Maria turns to an ancient ritual that promises to allow her to say goodbye to her son one last time. The ritual involves opening a door that separates the living from the dead and communicating with Oliver on the other side. However, the ritual is dangerous and comes with a warning not to open the door, as it will allow the dead to return to the world of the living. Ignoring the warning, Maria opens the door allowing her son to return to the world of the living, but not as she remembered him. As the story unfolds, the audience is taken on a journey through the depths of grief, loss, and the dangers of playing with the unknown. Maria's desperate attempt to bring back Oliver to life is a powerful reminder of the lengths a mother will go for her child and the consequences of ignoring warnings and playing with the forces of the afterlife. In this article, we will take a closer look at the scene. Mother brings her dead son back to life, thinking he would be the same, exploring the themes, characters, and lessons that can be learned from this powerful and haunting scene. The Movie Scene The movie opens with a heart-wrenching introduction to Maria, a grieving mother who has lost her son, Oliver, in a tragic accident. Struggling to come to terms with her loss, she turns to an ancient ritual offered by a mysterious woman, with the promise of allowing her to say goodbye to Oliver one last time. Maria believes that this is her only chance to find peace and closure. However, as she performs the ritual, Maria soon realizes that she has unleashed a horror beyond her imagination. Oliver has returned as a vengeful spirit, terrorizing her and her family. Frantic and terrified, Maria set out on a dangerous journey to close the door between the living and the dead, before it's too late. And this brings us to the scene in question. Mother brings her dead son back to life, thinking he would be the same. In this scene, Maria is consumed by her desperation and her love for her son. She believes that she can reverse the ritual and bring Oliver back to the land of the living, and that he will be the same loving son she once had. With tears streaming down her face, Maria begins to chant the incantation that will bring Oliver back to life. As Maria continues to communicate with Oliver on the other side of the door, the room starts to shake. The walls begin to creak and groan as if they are straining against an unseen force. The furniture starts to move, knocking over lamps and vases and creating an eerie sense of chaos. The ground beneath Maria's feet starts to rumble, and she can feel the floorboard shaking. The windows in the room crack and break, letting in gusts of cold air which swirl around Maria and Oliver, intensifying the sense of terror and dread. The entire room seems to be coming apart at the seams as if it's being torn apart by an unseen force. And then, just as suddenly as it started, the light fades, and Oliver is standing in front of her. But something needs to be fixed. Something just does not feel right. Oliver's eyes are dark, and his movements are slow and deliberate. He doesn't seem to recognize his own mother, and instead, his gaze is fixed on her with a cold, unyielding expression. Maria realizes too late that the ritual has brought back a monstrous version of her son, one that will stop at nothing to destroy her and her family. This scene is a masterful blend of heart-wrenching emotion and bone-chilling horror. The special effects, lighting, and sound design work together to create an atmosphere of dread and fear, as Maria is faced with the reality of her desperate attempt to bring back Oliver to life. The scene is both haunting and emotionally charged as Maria is torn between her love for her son and her fear of the monster he has become. In hindsight, it is haunting and emotionally charged scene that serves as a powerful reminder of the lengths a mother will go for her child. The scene highlights the immense love and devotion that mothers have for their children and the lengths they will go to protect them, even if it means putting themselves in danger. Moreover, the scene also explores the theme of grief and loss as Maria struggles to come to terms with the loss of her son. Her desperate attempt to bring him back to life is a testament to the human need for closure and the desire to hold on to the memories of loved ones. This scene shows how grief can sometimes lead people to make dangerous and irrational decisions and how the consequences of those decisions can be catastrophic. Furthermore, the scene serves as a cautionary tale about the dangers of playing with the unknown and the consequences of meddling with the forces of the afterlife. It warns against the idea that there is a way to cheat death and that dead should be allowed to rest in peace.